Navigating the real estate market successfully requires a keen understanding of its pricing strategies, particularly in the dynamic Milton real estate market. At any given time, there are multiple factors at play that affect the strategies and success of each depending on the micro market that you are in. The most effective pricing strategy can shift in the matter of weeks or even days. There are three primary pricing tactics, each with distinct risks and rewards. Deciphering these strategies is a necessity for a successful sale. Strategy number one is listing low and holding offers. This strategy involves listing the property at a significantly lower price than what is desired. This is typically anywhere between $50,000 and $250,000 less than the desired sale price. This approach aims to attract attention with seemingly unbeatable deals. Sellers then set a future date, usually within three to seven days to review all offers, creating a competitive environment. It is important to note that this initial listing price serves more as a marketing tool rather than an actual selling price, as sellers are highly unlikely to accept offers Offers at this level. This method is particularly effective in markets with low inventory and high demand, as it can generate significant interest and in multiple offers. However, there are a few risks to consider with this strategy. It can force buyers into making rapid judgments without sufficient deliberation or due diligence. This rush can lead to buyers making offers with no conditions at prices higher than they anticipated, and they may not be properly prepared appropriately should the home not appraise or if the home requires more work than they expected after the thrill and rush of offers has dissipated. There is also the possibility come offer day, the offers may not meet the seller's expectations or worse, there may be no offers at all. In such cases, sellers might choose to accept an offer lower than anticipated or opt to relist the property at a higher price. The reward of this approach lies in the ability to expose the property to a broad audience and allow market dynamics to determine its value, especially in an appreciating market where prices are constantly being pushed upward. This can be a powerful tactic. Additionally, it often results in firm offers and gives the sellers leverage in securing terms favorable to them, like their closing date. Strategy number two, listing at market value. This approach involves setting the price based on current market analysis and comparable sales, aiming to align your pricing with the sold prices for similar properties. This strategy is particularly effective in markets that are more balanced in terms of supply and demand or in higher inventory markets. This strategy often facilitates a quick and efficient transaction that often outpaces the competitors. The primary concern here is the potential regret of a rapid sale, leaving the sellers to ponder the possibility of a higher profit had they had waited. By choosing this strategy, sellers eliminate the stress and uncertainty of of waiting for an offer night and have set a justifiable price where if presented well, can even organically generate multiple offers. Depending on market conditions, sellers may experience shorter conditional periods or receive firm offers. Buyers often will have a strong sense of urgency with this pricing strategy. Strategy number three is traditional pricing. This traditional approach involves listing the property at a price that's two to 5% above the market value based on recent comparable sales while remaining open to offers at any time. It's a strategy designed for negotiation, allowing the sellers the flexibility to reduce their price during negotiations. This method is particularly suited for high-end properties and markets with fewer comparables or when a seller prefers a more negotiable stance and have time to sell. Adopting this strategy may lead to longer periods on the market, reduced interest, and potential buyer confusion, especially if they are unaccustomed to such pricing tactics. This could result in fewer showings and offers often with conditions attached. Additionally, there is a risk of needing to adjust the price if the property does not sell promptly, which 
could inadvertently stigmatize the property as buyers question its desirability. The key advantage of this strategy is the potential to engage buyers who may not be fully versed in the exact market values, thus enabling sellers to achieve a more advantageous sale. This approach provides sellers with a sense of assurance that they have explored the possibility of obtaining a higher price for their property, reinforcing their confidence that they have not undersold their home. This method resonates with sellers who value the art of negotiation. It not only allows them to test the market's upper limits, but it brings a level of engagement over the transaction. Every strategy outlined here holds its unique advantages and challenges, significantly influenced by current market dynamics and your specific objectives. Our aim is to arm you with the knowledge necessary to navigate the Milton real estate landscape effectively. We hope this was of value to you. And if you think someone you know may find this information useful as well, we would love for you to share it with them. Thank you for watching and we wish you great success in your real estate journey.